Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I figured I would end up doing a little kind of like fall haul and it's kind of stuff that I've accumulated over the past month. Um, I did get some stuff from Bath Body Works and I got some new clothes. So I figured I'd get on here and show you um, what I got. But yeah, I finally got my nails done. Thank the Lord. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I just figured I'd get on here and we would do a little fall haul. So let's get started. So first things first, I did go to Bath and Body Works. Um, they were having the favorite candles for $12.95, um, in store and online. And they were also doing a in store and online 25% off coupon that you received in the email. Um, so I got those and I kind of unmasked them, but kind of not. But the first one I got is, it's a Christmassy one, as you can tell by the jar. <laughs> um, but it's Spiced Apple Toddy. Oh my gosh, this reminds me so much of um, Christmas. And what's nice though is um, with these new Camp Winter candles, um, this new line that they're doing, I love this <laughs> reindeer. It's so absolutely cute. Um, all of these candles are made with essential oils, which is amazing. Um... I love this and the scent notes um is made with cinnamon and clove essential oils and notes of apple brandy and oh I just love this and the packaging is so absolutely cute it's kind of like this um, frosted glass jar um and of course I love the little reindeer on it um and then the top if you guys can see it um if I can put it on correctly um it's got like little christmas trees and like uh stars and snowflakes on it so i thought that was super super cute um sorry i ne never unwrap these because they always end up breaking another one i got from that um collection and it's not just that collection they have it in the regular packaging too it's just i really loved this packaging and they were 12.95 so might as well get the new cute updated packaging um but it is hot cocoa and cream Ugh. it smells like hot cocoa it really does it smells like smells like hot cocoa and it's got this cute little um squirrel and it's holding a coffee mug and it's wearing a little flannel if you guys can see that i thought that was really cute and the fragrant notes with this is made with notes of milk chocolate steamed milk and nutmeg essential oil this smells so good i really figured like this one i would put in my um living room when my leaves burns out um because i really love this and then this one i would put in my kitchen because it is hot chocolate so then it would smell like i'm cooking hot chocolate in the kitchen so i really loved that um the third one um, it's not like a particular um, thing. It's not like a certain brand, but they have these. Um, this is called You Had Me at Merlot. I believe is how you say it. Merlot, Merlot. I don't know. It's I think it's Merlot um, because I believe Merlot is a wine. So I believe that's what that is. But this smells so good, and um, it's just a normal packaging. And it says that dark, it's dark cherry, black raspberry, and sumptuous Merlot. So, it is, it does have wine in it. Um, and I love it. It is so good. I figured I'd put this in my bedroom. And then over the past couple, um, weeks, I have gotten some, um, what is it called? Clothes. <laughs> um, I did get this kind of, like, sweater. I don't know if you guys can see it. But I really do love it. Um, it's from Reese's, and then I got this tank top from, um, Meyer, and it's really cute because it's got, like, these little holes. I think it's a workout shirt, but I really loved this, and you guys, like, check out the back. It's got this really cute back detail. It's so cute. I am, like, in love with this sweater, though. It is, like, so comfortable. Um, and then I got, this is from Maurice's as well, like this was on sale. <laughs> um, I got this little, it's like a three quarter sh sleeve shirt, um, but it's nice because if you don't like this part, like it being buttoned, you can unbutton it. 
but I thought it was really cute. Um, it is kind of a teal, dark green color, and I love the lace detail on this. It is so pretty. Another thing I got from Maurice's, I believe this is from Maurice's, yes, is this sweater. Now, I love this. I love the detail on the front and it's spotted on the back as well. It's kind of like a see-through sweater, but I love that because I do get hot. That's why I never really wear sweaters or, or um, I always make sure I have a t-shirt underneath like my sweatshirts and stuff because I get super hot. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I'm a bigger girl. I get hot super fast. So this sweater is like if I can get it to stop sticking to stuff um but this is like perfect because it's like see-through it's lightweight it's it's like perfect and I got another flannel <laughs> um this isn't buttons or anything but it's just this cute like basic blue flannel um from Kato's and it's it's absolutely perfect I love Kato's clothing because I feel like they get plus size women um, because there was this jacket and I absolutely loved it and I don't remember where it was from um, but a friend had given it to me and my neighbor actually gave it to me and she, um, I loved this jacket and I've been hunting for it. It's like a, um, what's it called? A, uh, an army jacket is kind of what it was and I loved it. And I was like super excited because she had found this and she's like, I don't like it. Do you want it? I was like, yeah, sure. Why not? So I took it and I tried it on and it's like it fit fine. But if I went to go move my arms, it was too tight in the back and in the shoulder area. And I was so scared I was going to rip it. So I ended up just giving it to my boss because she loves that kind of stuff too. So yeah, but yeah, anyway. Um, the next thing I got is this cute little, this is from Jane Rick, I think is what it's called. It's this cute little, like, long sleeve sweater. Just like a pullover, not pullover, but like a, just a wrap kind of type of thing. I loved it because it was long sleeve. I don't have a lot of long sleeve, like, sweaters. Um, I like, like I said, I like having sweaters, or not sweaters, but like pull I like you call them pullers. Like things like this because even if they're long sleeve, because if I get hot, I can take it off. And you know, whatever. Be it but like sweatshirts, I have to make sure I have to have a t-shirt. Um, or if like another sweater, like it's hard with you know, regular sweaters. I have that cute sweater. If you guys looked at my fall, um, my fall tag, the sweater that I had in that, I absolutely love it and I haven't worn it because it's been kind of hot this fall. But, um, I probably will end up wearing it during the winter, but it sucks because, um, I'd have to make sure I bring, like, a t-shirt or have a t-shirt in my car or something to that fact because I get so hot. So, and I know I'm going to end up taking it off unless it's, like, super, super cold. Um, the next sweater is basically the kind of same thing, but this is, like, a three-quarter sleeve. It's just really cute. This is from Croft and borrow barrow borrow something like that i just got some of these like from like my neighbor gave me like a bunch of stuff and um goodwill um i got in clearance sections and stuff like that and i also got this other quarter sleeve um sweater i thought this was really really cute it's gray i love grays y'all know i love grays and then i just got this jacket from like walmart um because for one it's my favorite color <laughs> and for two um i just needed like a light jacket to keep with me especially like in the car or something if i just happen to get cold we do inventory at work um and we have to go into a freezer and that freezer gets you know obviously cold it's like negative like 40 degrees i feel like my eyebrows are lopsided sorry <laughs> so um having an extra jacket like we have I have a Hardee's jacket and I always end up leaving it in the car um but I can always wear a jacket into the store and just wear it when I go into the freezer when I do it anyway well I know it's not a long video but 
at least it's something, right? <laughs> um, I did get ready today. Me and a couple of friends are going to end up going out to dinner and going bowling um, for my birthday and my friend Katie's birthday. Katie is my niece's mom and we're super, or not super close, but we're close. Um, and her birthday is actually today. So we're going to go out and celebrate our birthdays um, and go out to eat and go bowling and just have some fun. Um, but I can't be out too late because I do have to get up and go to work in the morning. So anyway, like I said, always, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and you know, please subscribe if you haven't already. Um, but yeah, I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye.